High Willamette Class of 2020. Three years, eight months, and 23 days ago, I promised most of you at your matriculation ceremony that I would meet you today back on the quad for your graduation. And I'm sorry that we are not there physically together today. But I also, if you'll recall, promised you that we could all get here together with kindness and compassion and if we create a community. And you all have made good on that promise because you have been there for one another, living the motto together, non nobis solum nati sumus. Class of 2020, it's been a joy and an honor to take this journey with you. Congratulations. And now I invite you to join me in a moment of prayer or meditation. Holy One, maker of all and mother of all and lover of all that is, we invite your presence in the midst of our dispersal. We invite your presence in the midst of our joy. We invite your presence amongst us now. From the Botans to the Bistro, from Kaneko to the Quad, from the Star Trees to the Stadium, non nobis solum, we call this place home. From the Kalapuya who preceded us, to the faculty who welcomed us, to the classmates who've embraced us, non nobis solum, we are one community. From the rigors of the classroom to the labors in the library, to the footlights of the stage, non nobis solum, we have traveled well together. From the deserts and the mountains, from the Cascades and the coast, in the cities and in the fields, non nobis solum, we now are everywhere. From the tiniest organism to the grandest idea, from a single drop of rain to the mighty ocean, from this patch of earth to the expanse of our planet, non nobis solum, we call this world our home. From the sudden change of venue, to the gatherings on Zoom, to the acts of hope and kindness and the work for love and justice, non nobis solum, may we be the change. In gratitude for all the ways that we have known and lived the motto, we ask this in your many, many names. Amen. Somewhere across the fence.
Students, I am pleased to introduce your student speaker. Alexandra Binder is a biology and Chinese double major with Spanish and chemistry minors. A dual citizen of the Czech Republic, Alexandra now calls Alaska and Hawaii home. She is president of the Chinese Taiwanese Culture Association and founder and president of the Pre-Dental Club. Her senior thesis reviewed the traditional Chinese medicine technique of acupuncture as a treatment for pain and anxiety in dental patients. In her time at Willamette, she has enjoyed serving as an admissions ambassador and biology teaching assistant, volunteering with local organizations, making dumplings, and adopting four cats once she moved off campus. After commencement, Alexandra plans to stay in Anchorage while she completes her physics prerequisites for dental school. Class of 2020, here is your student speaker, Alexandra Tien Binder. Hello, class of 2020. More than ever before, our motto rings loud and true throughout these turbulent times. Non nobis solum nati sumus. Not unto ourselves alone are we born. Class of 2020, we are not alone. We are finally at the finish line. After countless late nights and a few too many bistro cookies, our undergrad career is complete. And surrounding us today are all of our biggest fans, our families, loved ones, friends, faculty and staff that have made our college experience memorable and meaningful. One of the most valuable gifts our Willamette education has afforded us has been the opportunity to make connections to last us a lifetime, even after we part ways today. More than that though, as Willamette students, we understand the importance of community. We are an academically rigorous institution with equally diligent students. As Bearcats, it is in our nature to advocate for each other. That truly is the Willamette way. That very spirit is one of the many reasons we have been able to support one another to get to this point in our lives. When I made the decision to commit to Willamette, I knew that our university's emphasis on community values was unparalleled. For many of us, the communities we have invested our energy and time into on campus are a driving force behind our success and character development. When we were all first year students, I don't think any of us imagined finishing our degrees from behind a computer screen. And yet, here we are. We have made the best of less than ideal circumstances, and as a result, we have grown together to embrace the spirit of adjustment and compromise in resilience, a very valuable skill that we will be able to carry into our futures and how we choose to approach our daily lives. I am honored to be a part of the class of 2020 and to have gotten to know so many of my fellow peers. I congratulate every single one of you for making it to where we are right now. Because even before the interruption of a global pandemic, I know the road hasn't been easy. I want to thank all of our families, friends, and professors for supporting us and guiding us through this passage in life. We could not have done it without you. It was not just us students who had to adapt to big changes at a fast pace but also our families, nests full again, sorry, mom and dad, and our professors who had to reconfigure entire semester plans into unfamiliar formats in a matter of days. Postponing or the thought of canceling our commencement was disappointing because it seemed that all of our devotion and hard work would not accumulate into a conventional celebration. But as disappointing as that is, it does not compare to the mass suffering and disruption of life COVID-19 has caused. Our own experiences during this time allow us to be mature and reflect, to see the bigger picture of what really matters in life, those we care about, members of our community. We also can take this time to reflect on how the past several years we have all been allowed the luxury of our primary job being to focus on our studies, often balancing that with other responsibilities but nonetheless, it has been a privilege to be a student, probably one of the best jobs we will ever have. But what better way to be launched into the real world than to be sent off with a reality check of the unpredictability of life outside of Willamette, outside of our red brick sanctuary of higher education. And we have already had some time to come to terms with our ever-changing reality, practicing optimism, kindness, and most importantly, social distancing. Class of 2020, we have made it this far together. 
Speaking before you today, from my bedroom, I am honored to be amongst some of the most hardworking and compassionate individuals this university has known. I am proud to become a Willamette alum and to be part of the growing diversity in the STEM field as a woman and a person of color. Every single one of us contributes to our university's legacy of what it means to be a dynamic individual. But we know there is strength in numbers and that we are more impressive together. Today marks a memorable transition in our lives as the first and hopefully only graduating class to ever have to experience a global pandemic. But we can graduate today knowing that our college and life experiences during our time here at Willamette have prepared us better for what awaits us in the future. Congratulations, non novus solum nati sumus. Hail to our dear Willamette, to the cardinal and the gold, glory to our alma mater, blessed with memories untold, your teaching in the years to come will guide in all we do, and to your praise we'll always sing, for we're Willamette too. There are those who've gone before us, still more to carry on. Year by year we add new voices to swell. President Thorsett, these persons have been recommended by the College of Arts and Sciences faculty as having met all the conditions for graduation from Willamette University. On behalf of the College of Arts and Sciences faculty, I recommend these candidates be awarded their degrees. By virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees of Willamette University and by the State of Oregon, and upon recommendation by the College of Arts and Sciences faculty, it is my pleasure to confer upon you the degree of Bachelor of Arts or Bachelor of Music with all of the rights, duties, and privileges thereto appertaining. As evidence thereof, you will receive the diploma of graduation bearing the seal of the university and the signatures of the proper officers of the corporation. Danielle Prema Abraham, Melissa Jean Ainsworth, Hannah Law Albano, Lauren Teresa Alexander, Vanessa Monique Amarez, Paolo Almaro, Sean Nilesh Amin, Erin Krista Amore, Tatiana Amrine, Philip Amour, Alyssa Quinn and Dyke, Jenna Elizabeth Arnold, Bradley Arvola, Tatiana Desiree Sefa. McKenna Lorena Auni, Nicholas James Bayman, 
Donia Bahar, Ivy Bakeman, Harky Ball, Nicole Banda, Ethan William Barshalon Frank, Kristen Marie Barclay, Alexis Barella, Alyssa Barnes, Reeves Mahan Bauer, Annette Bautista Feliberti, Callan Beaver, Maya Bennett, Twin Benny, Catherine Elizabeth Bick, Joya Beeble, Alexandra Tien Binder, Peyton Elizabeth Birchler, Emmett Blaney, Emma Sky Blau, Joanna Lucia Bohorquez, Kyle Bonn, Michael Dietrich Borchers, Catherine Bordona, Ben Marius Pursued, Kiana Anuhea Capolio Nalani Briones, Brittany Rose Lynn Broughton, Renee Ann Colleen Bruning, Kelly Elizabeth Buckler, Allison Buddy, Kellen Patrick Cooney Bulger, Maria Daniela Camacho Alarcon, Griffin Thomas Camel, Amira Cardenas, Katrina Mary Carter, Matthew Jordan Castaneda, Glenn John Eason Cervantes, Patrick Robert Charlton, Erlan Chavez Abalos, Oakley Chiapizi Livermore, Andrew Cho, Melissa Deanne Clark, Hayden Jacob Klein, Ellis Lynn Cobb, Taya Sky Chandel Cole, Emily Elise Coleman, Lauren Elizabeth Collar, Cameron Alexander Combs, Kiana Cook, Mason D. Cook, Michaela A. Costello, Richard William Craig, Tiana Creekmer, Casper John Francis Croft, Connor Crowley, Emilia Ann Kubelos, Gia Agatha Dakayanen, Madeline Elizabeth Davis, Skylar Renee Davis, Francesco DeFeo, Jordan Brian DeGilia, Hannah Natalie Dayton, Forrest Walker Dieters, Bailey Nicole Michiko Dickey, Jamie Laya Dole, Connell Eugene Doss, Isabel Spencer Landis Doss, Drew Carlson Draper, Reagan Jane Dryling, Hannah Naomi Drill, Hope Alicia Duenas, Tom Dunn, Nicole Dyer, Carol Ann P. Dyson, Alexander Joseph Efland, Lev Morgan Elascari, Ross Alexander Enlow, Dawson Anders Enright, Kelly Eileen Ewing, Bethel Yasu, Kane Maurice Farmer, Drew Marie Farmer, Joseph Lee Fodskar, Brielle P. Feinstein-Smith, Olivia Ann Fields, Marissa B. Fink, Colin Joseph Fisher, Killian Scott Fitzgerald, Julia Rose Fleener, Rodrigo Marcelino Flores, Yasmin Flores Lopez, Caitlin A. Forbes, Finula Moraine Fortune, Alexander D. Fufus, Kendall Kareen Fox, Samuel B. Frankie, Cole James Franco, Alec Burdett Frost, Anissa Gabriela Garcia, Sophia Kimberly Gardner, Gray A. Gotoro, Hunter Logan George, Spencer Ian Gerber Haddam, Elin James Tadami Giddings, Kealaula Ikeleni Britani Geyer, Emilia Louise Gingrich, 
Michael Antonio Giddens, Jocelyn Elaine Glasgow, Jack Henry Ray Glenn, Charlie Hayden Grant, Monica Noel Gray, Isabella Ketra Green, Johan Patrick Greaser, Megan Henley Grogan, J. Alexander Marsh Hadfield, Quinna Yvonne Hadley, Colin Aaron Hakeman, Elijah Milan Hall Crockett, Henry August Harder, Aubrey Huxham Kula Harris, Tessa Simone Harvey, Stephanie Autumn Hayes, Benjamin Basil Hedman, Jonathan Hendricks, Tessa Hendricks, Sylvia Rose Henley, Ellen Julia Hensley, Akela Hernandez, Lena Hannah Hoyman, Bennett Kin Kyung Toshiaki Ho, John Hochstetler, Gavin Honke, Cassin Evelyn Hopkins, Alexander Charles Michael Hogan, Haley McKenna Houston, Nicholas Donald Hoyt, Jacob Holty, Elizabeth Gerda Hyde, Ryan Frederick Ishinaga, Christopher Ishihara, Josiah James Jackman, JC Megan Jennings, Hai Jin Jiang, Rachel Marie Johnson, Sophie Kira Johnson, Madeline Grace Jones, Ari Angus Jeritsma, Diane Nancy Jung, Nikki Cates, Ellie Flora Kawada, Dana Alexis Curley, Shanna Kyle, Garrett Ryan Kaiser, Catherine Ann Kelly, Sophie Morgan Kelly, Mason Philip Kelleher, Caden James Kesey, Rosalind Zhongmi Kim, Yujin Kim, Bronson Doran Kerchik, Malia Renee Kirkland, Jaron Trenton Inoka Kobashikoa, Daniel James Koenig, Alicia Kostalecki, Amar Kshetrapal, Dakota Roger Cook, Karen Emmy Cooney, Lauren Elizabeth Lane, Sonia Laka, Jennifer Marie Lane, Riley Nicole Leng, Mark Konglu Lau, Dagny Celine Lehman, Jamie McCarthy Leary, Katie Michelle Lee, Kiana Naomi Lee, Shannon Gurina Lee, Melissa Legaria Cisneros, Samantha Allen Levy, Peter Joseph Lee, Hannah Rose Linville, Miranda Leanne Livers, Gary David Locker, Elizabeth Catherine Logsdon, Derek Takahash Ludwig, Natalie V. Lyle, Emily Ma, Thomas McDevitt, Sam Michael McDonald, Isabel Macias, Olivia Araby Mack, Haley Mackey, Helen Sky Medin, Sophia Ann Magnani, Genevieve Jenna Main, Madeline Rose Malone, Madison Malone, James Yado Mamwad, Caitlin Mariah Manker, Anusha Minava, Manuel Marcos Gutierrez, Phoebe Cameron Marcus Porter, Kirby Marion, Diana Marquez Guerrero, Tiffany Marie Paldanius, Kendall Matthews, August Kobe Mayeno, Kaylee Elizabeth Sandra McBain, Riley Karen McCann, Catherine McGonaghy, Brendan Wolock McGonagall, Merritt Meehan, Isabella Marlena Mejia, Uriel Mejia Rea, 
Olga Melendez Valdez, Genevieve Julie Melko, Scott Mowry Methner, Alexandra Nicole Meyer, Nairi Elizabeth Mitsky, Brandon Phil Miller, Cody T. Miller, Madison Lynn Miller McNeely, Natasha Alexandra Milligan, Takuma Kyle Mimura, Mina Ivan Mizutani, Michael Philip Montague, Mariko Catherine Moore, Tessa Moore, Emily Irene Morf, Lucy Logan Morrill, Catherine Morris, Shane Garrett Morrissey, Rachel Moulton, Marcella Maria Murillo, Margaret Elizabeth Murray, Devin Nakata, Corinna Brielle Nelson, Christopher Stephen Newby, Zia Marie Nichols, Madison Tyler Nigro, McKenna Elizabeth Hilani Noland, Alyssa Siobhan Oberg, Zoe Jordan Mary Okech Oduo, Jean Lewis Olson, Leah Nicole Olson, Cassiana Ray Omek, Ricky Oropesa, Sarah Quintina Ortiz, Claudia Ortiz Gajardo, Stuart Andrew Ovens, Enrique L. Pacheco, Eric Richard Pakowitz, Clinton Christopher Packard, Tanya Vianney Palafox Kachu, Alex Denise Palmer, Misty Dawn Parker, Jacob Michael Paulson Palmer, Andrew Christopher Pearson, Brian Patrick Peck, Morgan Emily Ann Penn, Arturo Primitivo Perez Lopez, Jean Pearl Jones, Christopher Lewis Perando, Lucas Dylan Perryman Deskins, Aspen Brooke Peterman, Brendan Arthur Peterson, Samuel William Mitchell Phillips, Charles John Focus, Maximilian Samuel Pichardo, Charles Michael Pipkin Jr., Claire Elise Paquel Wilson, Courtney Leanne Prairie, Megan Emily Pratt, Jillian May Pringle, Sonny Probst, Luca Charles Carollo, Ariel Rebecca Rabkin Meyer, Cynthia Natalie Ramirez Correa, Estefania Geraldine Ramos Torres, Jensen Bailey Rasmussen, Claire Annalie Reed, Rebecca Richardson, Tyler Patrick Riddick, Carlo David Rivas, Andrea Jamirath Rivas Iraeta, Morgan Rose Riva, Andrew R. Rodriguez, Mora Elizabeth Romano, Eric Thomas Roos, Edward Law Rose III, Naomi Rothenberg, Maya Eleanor Roussel, Corey Mazel Rowell, Parker Atkins Russell, Delaney K. Salazar, Lily Rose Salinas, Jelvin Cabanilla Sato, Olivia Denae Satterlin Stearns, Lydia Sarah Marguerite Berninger Savelli, Justin Edward Scanlon, Julia Ruth Schaefer, Virus V. Schmidt, Kaylee Jean Schuyler, Melissa Renee Scott, Olivia Scott, Emily Morgan Self, Anna Katharina Sirsch, Kyla Noel Shade, Michael John Shaw, Maya Rangini Shipway, Hannah Elise Shotwell, Aliyah Nicole Torres Sibug, Callan Skelton, Eunice Fami Slale, Benjamin Christopher Smith, Grace Elizabeth Smith, 
Jamie Casperson Smith, Lachey Nicole Smith, Emma Louise Small, Isabel Beatrice Solano, Kenna Miwa Elise Son, Jalen Sonoda, Kyler Hart Southcott, Callie Rosalie Spivak, Marinda Rose Stanton, Brendan David Staples, Andrew Carroll Starn, Anya Rose Stoyer, Alex Stevenson, Simone Lael Stewart, Lauren Ann Stiles, Brett Mark Stoner Osborne, Benjamin Douglas Stowe, Dawn Hunter Stewart Strobel, Annie Kathleen Strom, Joshua Stubbs, Mackenzie Elizabeth Giles Stevie, Kira Elizabeth Steiner, Emily L. Sue, Rebecca Mary Sullivan, Nadia Sultan, Sydney Lee Sandell, Trevor Michael Susla, Stuart Yoshiaki Suabe, Sage Nels Swan, Cameron Alexander Tangen, Matthew Stephen Taylor, Katrina Hiromi Thomas, Ari Thomason, Lexi Towner, Quan Tran, Colin Werner Troskin, Max Harvey Moana Turetsky, Amore Kor Ubi, Kelsey M. Erstad, Mako Kamakanakahia Okalani Ushijima, Willa Grace Van Lu, Nathan Gerald Van Diwali, Jacob Nguyen for Heiji, Benjamin James for Hooven, Claire Whitney for Strait, Noel Vitella Pardo, Quinn Thomas Wagner, Timothy John Wagner, Ziang Wang, Shelby Christine Weisberg, John Paul Welsh, Eden Isabel Mason Wenneker, Benjamin Kenneth Witten, James David Willis, Arabella Elizabeth Wood, Yakov Kobe Alpert Wood, Bailey Alexander Wyatt, Jishun Zinn, Hunter B. Yi, Samantha Forster Zamanik, Daniel Zepeda Lujano, and for the degree of Bachelor in Music, Thomas G. Carpenter. And there, family and friends, is the Willamette University graduating class of 2020. I hope graduates, wherever you are, you're wearing the mortarboard that represents your scholarly achievements. And if you are, then this is the moment that you should move your tassels from right to left, signifying the completion of your degrees. Congratulations, graduates. Each of you has traveled your own road to this point, some of you with detours along the way. Some of you started elsewhere before transferring to Willamette. A few of you even entered with the class of 2021, but raced to a three-year finish. When you came to Willamette, whenever you first came to Willamette, you became Bearcats. Today, in this Willamette's 179th year, we celebrate the fact that as alumni, you will always be Bearcats. One thing none of us could have predicted on that day I first met most of you, August 26th, 2016, under a great big tent, was where we would all be today. In fact, I promised you on that day that we would all be back together on this quad to celebrate. And among all of the disappointments of this disrupted spring, our inability to gather together in community, to gather with friends and family, with faculty and staff, and with our fellow students and friends, is one of the hardest disappointments to take. But on this commencement day, a day that is after all about celebrating beginnings, not endings, I don't want to focus on what's been lost, but on what comes next. At Willamette, we define our mission as preparing graduates to turn knowledge into action. And while we celebrate today what you have learned and done while you are 
have been enrolled as undergraduates, what we really celebrate is what you will do out in the world as Willamette alumni. Four years ago, you entered Willamette at an unusually dark moment in our national history. After a summer of violent tragedies that emphasized to all of us how far our nation had yet to travel in overcoming centuries of racism and segregation. I told you at the time that two thirds of Americans were telling pollsters that this country was on the wrong track. Those challenges are as evident today as they were then. And in many ways, the new coronavirus has sharpened our understanding of the fragility of our economy and our social safety net for the most vulnerable among us. Really, on a global scale, the current crisis has brought into focus both the importance and the complexity of addressing what are sometimes called the wicked problems, not just global public health, but economic security, food security, climate change, continuing war and conflict, and advancing the rights of women, of LGBTQ people, and racial and religious minorities here in the United States and around the world. But I told you four years ago that I am at heart an optimist and that universities like Willamette are fundamentally optimistic enterprises established and sustained on the premise that education is our best path to a better future. You leave Willamette with two great gifts. The first is a terrific liberal education that has prepared you to tackle complex challenges, to work in diverse communities, to lead in uncertain times. But the second gift is the gift of this disrupted spring. There is no getting around the fact that you have a bumpy road ahead. The usually obvious first steps into the workforce, the well-trodden paths others have followed into the world, seem, at least today, to be rockier and maybe even temporarily obscure. But as you take your knowledge and skills and think about the action that you want to take in the world, for all of your challenges, you also have an amazing opportunity. For people of my generation, the question is how do we return to normal? We have commitments to important institutions like Willamette University itself, and protecting and preserving those institutions, seeing them through this crisis, is the work that my generation is being called at the moment to do. You graduates have the freedom in the weeks, the months, and years ahead to do more, to look beyond that goal, to do something other than simply return the world to its previous patterns and configuration. Having seen the fragility of our economic structures, you must build a politics that protects the most vulnerable. Having experienced social distancing, you must build a society that leaves no one truly alone. Having seen just how connected our world really is, you must lift up and dignify the humanity of all people, however different or distant they may seem. In short, you, class of 2020, have been called on not to remake what came before, but to build a better and more just world. You don't face this generational challenge alone. You are all Bearcats together, and I would predict that in the years ahead, the abrupt sundering of this physical community that took place over spring break will fade in importance as you recall the shared experiences that you had together at Willamette. You will always be part of this university, your alma mater. We will take pride in your successes. We will remember you. We will tell stories about you. And you will remember this place, your professors, and each other. Stay in touch with each other. Reach out to other alumni for support. Be an alum who is there for future students. And I will say even more strongly than I usually do, come back for reunions starting next spring. Continue to nurture your Willamette friendships. It is hard to imagine, maybe hard to believe, the depth of meaning that you will one day draw from sharing the arc of your lifetime with the people who you knew well 
when you were young. But for now, class of 2020, as we bring this celebration to a close, let me bestow upon you the traditional Willamette President's Blessing. When you depart from this commonwealth of learning, may your life bring you some work of noble note. May you find meaning in your commitment to others, and may your memories of Willamette University be undying. Good luck and good cheer, class of 2020.